Hey, this is Basil with Grayson Hobby, and today we're going to talk a little bit about lithium polymer batteries, otherwise known as LiPos. Now, LiPos are in pretty much just about everything these days, from helicopters to airplanes to quadcopters to multi-copters. Even our transmitters now have LiPo batteries. And today, I'm going to show you a few tips and tell you about a few ways how to increase your battery life and how to increase the voltage out of them. So, the majority of the battery's lifespan is spent in storage, like this. And improperly storing a battery for days, months, weeks, or even years definitely will decrease the battery's lifespan and decrease the voltage output. All right, first, let's go over some facts about LiPos. Lithium polymer batteries are actually little chemical reactions inside the tin foil envelope inside the packs. Now, digging a little deeper about the chemical makeup of batteries, we have to go back to our high school chemistry classes. Now, remember, a chemical reaction speed doubles for every increase of 10 degrees in temperature. That's why LiPo batteries do not work well in cold weather. So as LiPo batteries age, their internal resistance increases and their discharge rate decreases. So what's that mean? It means your once 30C pack is now probably 25C. And what does that mean to most of you? Well, it means your full throttle is not actually full throttle anymore. It's a lot less power. Also, as LiPos age, their capacity decreases, meaning less flying time. So once was a 10 minute flight is now probably an eight minute flight. It's also known that once a battery reaches 20% of its maximum capacity, the pack is trash and time to get a new pack. All right, so I gave you some background information on LiPos and you're still probably scratching your head, what does all this mean? So let's get into the storage. So a fully charged lithium polymer battery is actually 4.2 volts per cell. Now the ideal storage voltage is going to be 3.85 volts, which is about half charged. I know the math doesn't make sense, but trust me, 3.85 volts is the storage voltage you want to have. Temperature. Remember back earlier we talked about the colder the temperature, the worse the battery actually is used. Well actually in storage, that actually helps us out because we want to decrease our chemical reaction time. So what's that mean? It means ideally you want to put your lipos in the refrigerator but we do not suggest that. So what I suggest to do is in the summertime, you bring your lipos in in a storage bag and keep them out of the hot car and definitely the hot garage. There are several tools you can use to check your voltage of each battery. We have this battery checker here. It also tells you your pack voltage. We have this little very basic voltage meter. It tells you the voltage per cell. And we also have this watt meter slash voltage meter slash balancer that does the same thing. Even the high-end chargers and mid-grade chargers will tell you the voltage per cell. Most mid-range battery chargers have a store mode which will bring up the voltage to the proper level. And the higher end models will actually bring down your voltage and or bring up your voltage to the proper storage level. Okay, I'm going to show you how to store your batteries with this Dynam Supermate LiPo charger. It's real simple to do. First, you want to make sure you get your uh, battery packs out of your protective lipo bag. So I'm going to pull out this one here. I'm going to do it, give it a quick check. 3.84, which is about right. That's what we're looking for. All right, so now I'm going to take my second pack here. It's the one I just used. At least I think I just used it. All right, 3.7. So this little pack is very low and I need to bring it up to the storage voltage. So I'm going to get to my Dynam charger. And right now it's on the charge mode. So I'm going to arrow over until it says store. All right, so there it is. So this is the 3S pack. Hook it up. It's all set up. All I got to do is hook it up. So before you put your packs away for the season or even for the week, make sure you put them in storage mode. Thanks for watching. This is Basil with Grayson Hobby. 114. 114.